Your devices and we are here at MWC 2014 announcing about the second generation of Yoda phone launch. So we are having, I have in hands now the very first prototype for the next generation Yoda phone. Actually, the main difference is that it, it is as twice as smart, twice as beautiful, and twice as useful as the uh, current version of the product is. Uh, but the main difference is that it receives a, a touch. Uh, always on display, so actually it can react on your on your touches. You can actually interactively act with the with the notifications. You can open them directly from the always on screen. And uh, actually, this is the main difference. So now, with this type of functionality, uh, we will provide to to the users absolutely new user experience with the dual screen smartphone. And actually, now users will be able to accept calls, make calls, accept and answer and react on SMS, emails, uh, and different type of, of, of tweets, etc. Now the browsing experience of the of, of the back screen is is, is much more com convenient, much more comfortable, much more natural. For example, if you were if you uh, tracking your uh, Facebook, for example, on, on the on the always on display, now you can. Uh, change pages uh, uh, and navigate with the, in a natural way. You can uh, like your favorite tweets or, or go deeper and uh, and read it and, uh, and 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 then browse and back to the to the RSS uh, stream. Uh, another thing is that the, uh, the reading experience on the on the on the on the always on screen is now it's much more comfortable, much more smooth and. Uh, Nice, uh, and you still have an access to all notifications uh, we have on the on the, always on display. So uh, this device will receive uh, will have a snap Qualcomm Snapdragon quad core 2.2 megahertz processor, uh, 2550 mAh battery, pretty powerful one, NFC wireless charger. Uh, bigger screen with the full HD resolution 5 inch and the improved resolution for the for the always on display um, the next generation of the phone will go on sale in Q4 this year uh, the price for this device will be uh, premium Android devices price uh, it will uh, be launched in the Europe, Russia, Middle East, and some other countries. And two months later, will be available in US and in China. These are our plans. So, uh, uh, as soon as consumers receive a uh, full touch experience with the always on display, now we will be in, we will introduce in this device. We'll be able to introduce in this device kind of a power uh, smart energy uh, mode, so you can uh, actually en disable for some time. Uh, highly power consuming um, color screen display uh, if you need really use device longer and uh, and uh, actually if a consumer can buy user can can back actually to the to the to the uh, full HD display uh, when they need uh, more multimedia full HD uh, quality content surfing and all context uh, surfing related to the text or uh, any kind of uh, um, digi uh, graphic da graphical data like for example our uh, dashboards like this then they can use it on the from the always on the always on display uh, and use it much longer uh, if they will not be activating the the, the, the phone screen so that's actually that's actually it there are main features uh, we are ready to announce now. Will be also fitness tracker, photocaster, so people will be able to, to track data uh, for their favorite and watch and, and uh, track uh, updates for example of the, of how their favorite sport team performing and, and, and so on and so far. So these are key things. Thank you very much for watching.